Hey everybody and welcome to another edition of Bookshelf Tuesday. Today we finish my A section with my Douglas Adams books. If you have never read Douglas Adams before, well it's about time you picked up a novel and filled that gap in your life that you didn't know existed before. Douglas Adams' writing is hilarious and you find yourself laughing out loud all the time. And his stories are interesting to say the least and his visions, they're inspiring. Douglas Adams is most famous for his Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy trilogy. It's a science fiction comedy that comes in five parts and it's a must read in my book as the world just brims over with references to this series. In the first book we meet the characters. Arthur Dent, the hapless Englishman who tries to save his house from being torn down but hitches a ride on the Vogan spaceship instead with his friend Ford. Ford Prefect turns out to be an alien researcher for the Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy. An encyclopedia and travel guide, it holds answers to almost everything and gives advice to the traveler. After their escape from Earth, they meet Zephyr Beeblebrox, Ford's cousin and the galactic president, who travels with Trillian, a woman Arthur once met at a party and liked, but she left Earth six months prior to its destruction. In the restaurant at the end of the universe, our friends get separated. Zephyr discovers that he's part of a conspiracy to reveal the real ruler of the universe and Ford and Arthur are transported back to prehistoric Earth. In Life, the Universe and Everything, our heroes escape prehistoric Earth and help prevent the destruction of all life in the universe. So Long and Thanks for All the Fish returns Arthur to Earth, while well, a replacement Earth. He falls in love with Fenchurch and together with Ford Prefect they hitchhike to see God's final message. Mostly Harmless is the fifth book in the trilogy and the last written by Douglas Adams. Arthur Dent has settled down on a remote and quiet planet as a sandwich maker. But when Trillian drops off their daughter random, that's when trouble starts again. Douglas Adams also wrote two humorous detective novels. Dirk Gently is not your average detective, as his methods are random, as are his cases. In Dirk Gently's Holistic Detective Agency, he visits about the world, the universe and time itself, as a group of eccentric characters help him find an eccentric cat, solve a murder and save the human race. The novel is non-linear, obviously, as time travel is involved. The Long Dark Tea Time of the Soul is the second adventure and I like this better than the first one. It starts with an explosion at a passenger check-in at Heathrow Airport and has gently dealing with gods. The novels are difficult to summarize as so many things happen at the same time, but reading them is just pure fun and mind-boggling. Douglas Adams also wrote a dictionary together with John Lloyd. The meaning of live is a dictionary of things that there aren't any words for yet. Thanks for watching Bookshelf Tuesday and have a very nice day. Bye bye.